What is up my beautiful friends? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Today we're doing a pack with me. We are going to Hawaii and while I upload this, you guys, I'm actually in Hawaii. So if you want to see some pictures and stuff and catch up with me, I will be vlogging it, but you guys can also check out my Instagram. I'll have it on the screen or you guys can find the link down below in the description. But today we're doing a pack with me. I'm going to show you guys the things I'm packing, some of the travel essentials that you guys need when you guys are traveling. And yes, let's get on with it. Nothing too special. I know it's a mess behind me, but uh, these are the clothes that I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna try and not overpack. I've been really trying not to overpack. It's really hard for me because that's all I do is always overpack. So let's do this. All right, also if I'm moving a little weird, my back is still janky. Um, if you guys wanna check out my video of why my back is janky, I'll have it linked down below. But we're going to try and do our best to pack this. I've been really putting this off. I've been really like delaying it because my back has been hurting. But we're literally leaving tomorrow. And uh, I need to pack. These are the clothes. This is pretty much what we got for the clothes. There's a couple more clothes that are going through the wash right now. But these are the main ones that I'm going to pack. The other ones are more like exercise clothes, which I know for sure I'm going to bring. So these are more of like the non-exercise clothes that I'm going to bring. These are usually the things I overpack. But yeah, this is what we got. And uh, we're going to try and like organize this, make this a little organized and go through the clothes that I need and I don't need. <music> All right, it, I know it looks like a mess, but it's kind of organized. We got the clothes laid out. This is like my maybe pile. I want to bring these, but I don't know if I'm actually going to wear them. I got my sweater here, got like a beach cover up, my bathing suits here, some tops here, and some dresses here, some kimonos and some like cardigans here. We got our shorts here, workout tops here. PJ bottoms, leggings, which we are gonna add to. I have like three more pairs and then also some sports bras. We're actually planning on doing like a lot of hiking there. So that's why I'm bringing a lot of sports wear. Hopefully my back will be okay to do a lot of it. I think it will be, but yeah, that's why I'm bringing a lot of sports clothing. I know not everyone does that, but we want to work out and hike and do things like that there. So that is why we're bringing a lot of workout clothes, but yeah, that's pretty much what I got. But I think I'm overpacking still, I don't know. I have a little friend helping me pack. She's also getting in the way quite a bit. Also a very helpful tip is to bring extra boot pads. It's always good to have them. You never know when you'll need them. I like bringing an extra pair just in case. I think I'm officially not going to bring these things. I think I can leave them here. I have everything packed in here, pretty much. I have almost all the stuff. Like I said, I just have my workout clothes. I still have some leggings and some sports bras to add. I also have some socks and underwear to add to here. But pretty much that's the bulk of it. I think I'll be okay. I might add a couple more shirts in there because I feel like I don't have a lot of shirts. But that's the bulk of it. And then over here we have the stuff that I'm gonna be wearing. This is just a sweater and a cropped black tee that I'm gonna wear with some leggings on the airplane. And then also a tip, if you guys are traveling on the airplane to always bring an extra change of clothes for your carry-on just in case your luggage ever gets lost, you have some clothes for a day or two. So I'm just bringing these guys with me in the carry-on. All right, so now we are in my poorly lit bathroom. But I'm gonna show you guys what I'm bringing, like my toiletries, things like that, you know, the basic stuff that I need to bring. So of course, I'm bringing a little one for my carry-on and then I'm also gonna bring a nice big bad boy for my luggage to carry most of the majority of the stuff. All right, so I've already kind of pre-packed some stuff I have in here. 
I just have a bunch of hair elastics and like bobby pins and things like that because your girl needs hair elastics. My hair needs to be up quite often. And then I also have to actually run out and get some conditioner, but I have some shampoo and I'm just going to get some conditioner. This is a Love and Beauty Planet shampoo and it smells really good and it also I feel like it smells like Hawaii, like coconut kind of style. I'm also bringing some deodorant. I'm just bringing my Tom's one that I have that is just one that I use quite often. I'm actually going to put that in my carry-on so that I have deodorant in case my luggage ever gets lost. Also, I'm just bringing this nail polish. I still have to do my nails, so I'm not going to pack it right now, but uh, bring the nail polish that you guys put on your nails so that you have it there in case they chip or break or anything like that. Also, a container of some coconut oil. I use coconut oil for a big moisturizer for me, so I'm bringing some of that with me as well. And of course, I'm bringing these two Pixie products. It's just a toner and a serum. These I've been using in my face recently. I love it so much. And then I'm also bringing this Pixie Sun Mist. This is just like SPF, has SPF in it, and it like protects your face, cause you know, you wanna protect your face. Also I'm bringing the Sun Bum Sunscreen. Now I know a lot of sunscreens are actually harsh on some of the coral reefs in Hawaii. They're having a huge problem with that. So you wanna buy one that is oxybenzo free. And so that is what we're picking up and we are bringing. So that one actually is free of that. I'm bringing my Kalamazoo. This is just my face wash that I use. And then of course, gotta bring my pumps. I have asthma obviously. And so I gotta bring these bad boys with me. I'm also bringing this natural toothpaste. This is just the green beaver toothpaste that we use. We also use the Tom's one, but this is just one that's easier to travel with. I'm bringing my face cloth. So this is just what I remove my makeup with. You just put some water on it. So much better for the environment. So I'm bringing that as well. I have some aloe for some after sun. I'm also bringing this little bad boy. It's like one of those, you know, takes the hair off. And that's pretty much it of the like kind of special things that I'm bringing. I'm also gonna bring a lot of makeup, makeup that I, you know, use. I probably won't be wearing too much makeup, but it's always fun to have that as well. And this is pretty much all that we're gonna pack. In my carry-on, I have a second pump for me because asthma, you don't wanna be stuck without it. I also have some chapstick, some hand cream, and some good old Dramamine. So if you guys are like car sick or anything like that, always bring Dramamine with you. David has one for himself. I have one for me in case we lose one. We have one, so I'm bringing some of that as well, and then I'm also just bringing clips and hair elastics as well. All right, so that's pretty much it for all the toiletries that I'm bringing. Like I said, I'm gonna pack my makeup. I also have a couple more jewelry items I want to bring as well, like some bracelets and things like that. Um, but that's pretty much it. Also, I'm gonna pack a razor. Gotta pack that. Ooh, I almost forgot about that. So let's move on to what I'm bringing in my carry-on. Before we start on with my carry-on, I want to share with you guys the shoes that I'm gonna bring. I completely forgot to show that for you guys. I'm bringing a lot of pair of shoes, which are probably, well, they are necessary. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get a use out of all of them, but I'll share them with you guys. So of course I'm bringing my slides and I'm also bringing a pair of flip-flops because we're going to the beach. You wanna have these. Also, I'm probably gonna wear my slides on the airplane because it's just comfier and easier to wear. I'm also bringing a pair of Converse because your girl always has to have a pair of Converse, of course. So I'm just bringing a pair of these guys. And then I'm bringing two pairs of running shoes. These are ones I'm gonna use for hiking and if we manage to do CrossFit or if I manage to actually start exercising and trying some CrossFit, I'll be wearing, of course, my Metcons. So I'm just bringing these two because I don't want these guys to get, to get dirty when we're hiking because it can be very muddy and things like that. So I'm bringing these old running shoes. But let's start off with the carry-on. So I'm bringing my purse. This is just like a little small purse book bag. And then I'm also bringing my big book bag, my Infinity book bag that I literally bring like everywhere with me. I have everything laid out of what we're gonna bring because I had to clean out my book bag. It was a disaster. All right, so we got some snacks because we are doing some big flights. They are very long, so we got some snacks with us, some vegan chocolate bars, and then some Cliff bars, some ginger chews, which are good if you're sick. It's good to have some ginger, so we're having that. Also gonna bring our Purell. And then this is just a charger that I have that is like, you know, has a wireless charger, if that makes sense. Got my wallet, of course. Also for snacks, we got some dry mangoes. We also got some gum. It's always good to have some gum. I am also bringing headphones, typical, the tripod for the camera, and also some wet ones and some tissues. And then I'm also bringing this guy here. This is my softball that I usually roll out my muscles with. I'm also gonna bring my small foam roller as well. Because my back is so janky and I'm having a lot of issues with it, I am going to bring those two things, the softball and the foam roller, so that 
I can just roll out my back when I need to so that if I have any knots or if I really need to just release the muscles in my back because they're very tight, I have them with me. I also have a baseball cap and I'm also bringing just some document things that I need to bring. And then also I have my medication here because your girl is on a lot of medication. I'm also bringing these turmeric pills. This is really good for inflammation. It helps with reducing inflammation. It's an anti-inflammatory food. And then also over here, I'm actually gonna put this in my suitcase, but this is actually my workout stuff. I have my grips here. I have my weightlifting belt. I have my skip rope, my wrist wraps, and these are just some banded elastics that I have in here. I don't know if I'll be needing this, let alone these things. I probably will not use them because I cannot lift heavy weights still. I'm like really still starting from the beginning, doing really light work. So I'm bringing them just in case, but I probably will not lift weights, so I might not need them but you never know and I don't wanna be stuck without them. But these are things I'm gonna actually put in my suitcase because it's unnecessary to put in my carry-on. But those are just some of the gym items that I'm gonna bring. These are my items that I love to have, especially if I wanna do double unders. I have my skip rope, I have my wrist wraps if I need them. I just prefer having my stuff with me. And then we're just going to pack our electronics. We're gonna bring the laptop as well. That's like a last minute thing that we need. And then some cameras, some chargers, memory cards, things like that, the little things electronic things that's pretty much it but let's get to putting all of this in the bags in their appropriate spots All right guys, so those are all the items that I'm gonna pack with me. I still have a couple more like last minute things. I still need to get like conditioner and just add in the electronics because those still need to be charged. So that's pretty much it. Those are the essentials that I need. I have my gym clothes that are still being dried and I gotta pack those shoes that I just showed you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. It really helps the channel. And if you're not already subscribed, hit the subscribe button down below. There will be a lot more Hawaii vlogs. I'm so excited for it. And yes, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Summer days burn me out. Love just brings me down. Go inside like winter leaves that slowly leave the ground. Hey, you come back, I wanna give you a chance Love me like you used to, so we can learn again The skin is getting round, baby, drink tonight